None of us actually think it's going to happen. It's supposed to happen to somebody else. It's not supposed to happen to you. But it does happen to you. It happens to all of us. My baby was around six weeks old at the time. And I said, something's wrong with my Evangelina. They said, no, you're just stressed. You're a new mom. And I said, no, something's wrong with Evangelina. I was informed that she had absolutely no immune system. Anything can get her sick, and anything that can get her sick could kill her. Marissa is my eldest girl, and she was born with sickle cell. When you have sickle cell, the inner parts of the body that depend on blood supply don't get it. And it's almost as if inside the bone marrow, you are suffocating. Let's face it, you don't plan for the sick kid. You never plan for the sick kid. But I was so blessed. I was blessed the moment my children were born. And honestly, I was blessed the moment we got that spot in Dr. Cohn's trial. The work that I do is trying to develop new ways to treat blood diseases. And what we're trying to do is take the patient's own bone marrow stem cells and fix genes that are broken in them. One type of patient we've worked on are the kids with a disease called Severe Combined Immune Deficiency, or SCID. And these are kids who have no ability to fight infections. She never went outside. Her sister never went outside. If we have a visitor, it was gowned, masked. Though it was literally the worst time of my life, the doctors were amazing. We felt this faith with Dr. Cohen just speaking to him. I know that he loves my daughter. We were at UCLA for around six weeks, and this last meeting, he tells me she could definitely be taken outside and everywhere else. Take her out. I kissed my daughter for the first time two weeks ago. <laughs> She's 19 months and I finally just kissed her on the mouth. Do you know how amazing that was? I'm in his here graduating from college. And I'm gonna be at her wedding. The work that Dr. Cohen does will definitely benefit my daughter. For the sickle cell work that's coming up, we've been working on it for the last four and a half years to get to the point to take it to patients. We need the true believers in education and science to help us. That will be really the question of the trial is, can we get this gene that blocks the sickling into enough of their stem cells to correct their disease? Dr. Cohen has not given up. His work is important and will change lives. It has given me strength. No kid should be maintained. They should be cured. Let there be tiny miracles. Let there be a cure. <laughs>